Last time. Wanna play a game? We're reliving the Dongar questline as an illusion, but also you could die, get wrecked, nerd. So welcome to Fort Dongar. Soreen, you'll find room to start your tinkering on that crossbow design you've been working on. I will be happy to assist you with your Elder Scroll. I don't want to be horny anymore. I just want to be happy. Sorry, I'm kind of a bad person. It's okay. I'm complex and have a tragic backstory. I'm giving you the chance to walk away from this now. Probably not. Prophecy, prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Dragons, ancient blood. I think I know where we can start looking. Gunmar and I agree that we're going to need Florentius to help. I want to add some punch to our crossbow capabilities. Just gonna say Florentius real quick. I already got the crossbow plans last time. Hell yeah, sister. Pro gamer move. Pull her into the fire. Cool, quick and easy. I don't know where Galas is. This is Seapoint Settlement, which is across from Volkahar. Are we going to settle in for the night? Or I love new town mods. Dang, I think I need to get precision archery. I should have been a bar wench. It seems a lot safer than traveling with you. She's not wrong. Boy, the last to actually train his snake. The old water system. On some days, this would smell just. I'd be glad you weren't here then. <laughs> I just casually stepped out of the way of that trap. Whoopsie, well don't step in front of me. I was trying to blow up this dog. And she's okay.
What happened to this place? Everything's been torn down. The whole place looks... Well, dead. It's like we're the first to set foot here in centuries. This used to lead into the castle's great hall. Looks like my father had it sealed up. I used to walk through here after evening meals. It was beautiful once. This was my mother's garden. It... Do you know how beautiful something can be when it's tended by a master for hundreds of years? She would have hated to see it like this. Wait. Something's wrong with the moon dial here. Some of the crests are missing and the dial is askew. I didn't even know the crests could be removed. Maybe my mother's trying to tell us something. I'm telling you, there's something strange with the moon dial. Okay, okay, I got it. It's a puzzle. Hang on. You okay? I still can't shake what happened with Gillis. Flashback to three in-world hours ago, anime style. After this scene, you're supposed to dismiss Gallus, but I could not get her to stop following me. My best in-game explanation is Serana is a master of illusionist slash vampire, which is how she influences the Dragonborn when she wakes, and also my explanation for this illusory world. But maybe she used that power to make Galice forget, and is too intrigued by what she sees to let her go just yet. Ready, ladies? It'll be a long journey, but I think we are. Before we go, I want to thank you for trusting me. Will you stop acting like a fucking victim all the time? You're a vampire. At least act like it. Yeah. Bite me. I have no idea why he would trust you, but I don't. You're just another vampire that can't control her urges. What's this? I see what you're doing, and it's working. <sighs> Shit. You stupid fucking bitch. What the fuck is wrong with you? Damn. We need to go. Vampires do not fear much. The sun, maybe. And a few other things. But her eyes... I could see my very existence disappearing. More research is needed, maybe? I saw something in her eyes that a vampire should never see. It's the first time since I was turned that I felt fear. She's definitely not a normal woman. Orc slash wood elf is strange enough, but she's got glowing eyes, like you guys. At the same time, not like you guys. Let's just drop it for now. I need something to take my mind off this. Maybe we should take- Come I'm here. Keep talking, like I'm not standing right here. But, you're right to fear me. Is this really the place to suck face, you nasty fox? If it's the thought that counts, well, you should probably be in jail. Clever, mother. Very clever. I've never been in those tunnels before, but I'd bet they'd run right under the courtyard and into the tower ruins. Well, at least we're getting closer. Let's go. So far, this hasn't been too bad. Anybody notice that thing over there? Of course, you'd have to be blind. Why, you thinking about attacking it? Your mom be the real thing. The Night Mitron is a strong ancient vampire lord that keeps to herself. Well, the illusory world is for training and experience, right? Think we can take it? Probably. YOLO. a decent challenge but the AI seemed to get confused there at the end and just like stop attacking Maybe it's 
smarter than I gave her credit for. to be it. I knew she was deep in the necromancy. I mean, she taught me everything I know. But I had no idea she had a setup like this. Damn. This is a hell of a laboratory. Look at all this. Damien would love She this. must have spent years collecting these components. And what's this thing? I'm not sure about this circle. What exactly are we looking for? My mother was meticulous about her research. If we can find her notes, there might be some hints in there. Looking at the equipment and materials, it looks like she was trying to advance her necromancy. I remember she used to keep a small journal. See if you can dig it up. Found it. You did? Let me see them. If I'm reading this right, there's a formula here that should give us safe passage into the soul care. What do we need? A handful of soul gem shards, some finely ground bone meal, a good bit of purified void salts. <sighs> What's wrong? We're also going to need a sample of her blood. Which, if we could get that, we wouldn't even be trying to do this in the first place. You share her blood? Hmm, not bad. We'd better hope that's good enough. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get started. Best strategy for this quest is just to run through the room and grab every single object. I already found all of the ingredients. Oh good. Well then, let's head over to the portal vessel and I'll do the rest. Then the rest is up to me. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to do when I add my blood. Let's get that portal open. Alright, here goes. By the blood of my ancestors. She actually did it. Created a portal with a soul game. Incredible. I'm ready. I know this is difficult for you. I hope you trust me. I'd never do anything that could hurt you. I trust you completely. Thank you. Let's not waste any more time then. I promise to make this as painless as possible. Hold still. Gilles, wait here. Fine by me. I'm not gonna let her so trap me. Look at this place. The smell here. Let's try to handle this quickly. Looks like we'll be dealing with the smell of rot while we're here. Lovely. If she really is here, I wonder how my mother managed to deal with it. I deal with it fine. How do you manage to deal with it then? For a walking corpse, you don't smell terrible. Me? I smell like nightshade and snowberries. You know what? You should be talking. If you think you smell like blossoms after frolicking in a fetid cave, you are sorely mistaken. But, hey, you're actually not too bad. For a sand rat. Snowback bloodsucker, you know I've never even been to Hammerfell. Porker face. Milk drinker. Well, that is just not true anymore. <laughs> I'm starting to like you, okay? You're growing on me. I feel like we should pause for Galeste to make a joke about me growing on you. <laughs> Let's find my mother and find a way out of here. Let's keep moving. I feel like we're being watched. Serana? Is it really you? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the prophecy, hasn't he? No, you've got it all wrong. We're here to stop him. To make everything right. 
wait a moment. You've brought a stranger here? Have you lost your mind? No, you don't... You, come forward. I would speak with you. So how has it come to pass that a vampire hunter is in the company of my daughter? It pains me to think you'd travel with Serana under the guise of her protector in an effort to hunt me down. Not a ruse. Hi, Grandma. Coming from one who murders vampires as a trade, I find it hard to believe your intentions are noble. Serana has sacrificed everything to prevent Harkon from completing the prophecy. I would have expected her to explain that to you. Prophecy, prophecy, etc. Elder Scroll. You think I'd have the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her Elder Scroll alone? The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's bow. The second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. Well, that's not very nice. I'll let Parthenax know. Like myself, Serana was a human once. We were devout followers of Lord Molig Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summoning day. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure-blooded vampire. By offer, do you mean? Like Vivek offer? Fucking gross. Molag Balls is truly the worst of the evil Daedra. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Serana, and why I've kept the other Elder Scroll as far from her as possible. Are you saying Harkon means to kill her? In his eyes, she'd be dying for the good of all vampires. But she wouldn't, though. Do I need to pull up the food chain diagram again? How exactly do you plan on stopping him? Same thing as always. Brute force, of course. Explosions and whatnot. If you believe that, then you're a bigger fool than I originally suspected. Don't you think I weighed that option before I enacted my plans? And Serana's opinion? You care nothing for Serana, or our plight. Whether or not you've become one of us in order to survive the Soul Cairn... I haven't. You're still a vampire hunter at heart. You're here because we're abominations in your mind. Not your fault. Evil creatures that need to be destroyed. This stranger aligns himself with those that would hunt you down and slay you like an animal. Yet I should entrust you to him. Oh, sir, if you'd only open your eyes. The moment your father discovers your role in the prophecy, that he needs your blood, you'll be in terrible danger. So to protect me, you decided to shut me away from everything I cared about. You never asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. You just expected me to follow you blindly. Both of you were obsessed with your own paths. Your motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you too. But we have to stop him, before he goes too far. And to do that, we need the Elder Scroll. I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. I didn't see. I've allowed my hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. If you want the Elder Scroll, it's yours. Your intentions are still somewhat unclear to me. But for Serana's sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. Destroy the Keepers, and it should bring the barrier down. Trying to separate him from his little crony so I can not fight multiple guys at once. I've got an idea. Huh. 
hat. Got ya. There he is. Nice shield. Yeah, I ran out of fire shot in the Invulcar castle, so I'm using Frost now. Oh, hey, Serana finally joined me. Guess she got tired of waiting. I love her using Vampire Lord in dire situations. That's such a great, simple mod. You managed to destroy all three keepers? Very impressive. The power of Dwemer Tech. Can you give us the scroll? Yes. Please follow me. Keep watch for Dernevere. With the prison's barrier down, he's almost certain to investigate. Wait, I hear something. It's like seeing one of my mom's old war buddies. Let's get you the Elder Scroll, and you can be on your way. I'm glad you're here. I don't think I could be doing this before. Now that you've retrieved the Elder Scroll, you should be on your way. If there's anything I can do before you depart, you must let me know. We'll return for you when we can. I appreciate your concern for me, but Serana is all that I care about. You must keep her safe at all costs. Remember that Harkon is not to be trusted. No matter what he promises, he'll deceive you in order to get what he wants. And promise me you'll keep my daughter safe. She's the only thing of value I have left. Stay your weapons. I would speak with you, Quenarin. There's no need to have this conversation. It was a good fight, but I can't summon you with shouts, Derny. Sorry. You are the Dragonborn's son, and hold the breath of Kain. Yep. Half Nord and blood of a Dragonborn. By all accounts, I should be able to shout better than Runa, but no luck. I'll teach you the words. Work on it in time. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is right. Come on, let's go home. I'm more worried about Gallus. There seems to be a lot of mystery surrounding her. Gales is just Gales. He'll let us know if there's trouble. It's strange. I didn't like her at first. Then I realized she was just being protective of you. Let's focus on the task at hand, okay? You're right. We need to get my father taken care of. Okay. Okay. Hey. Thanks. Just to be clear, I'm here for him, not for you. I will admit, after hearing a bit about your past, I can understand a little bit of your resentment. 
But you're a fucking vampire that's acting like a bitch. It's hard to not think you're fucking stupid. You know you're the only person who calls me that, right? I'm sorry I hurt your feelings when I called you stupid. I really thought you already knew. <laughs> Holy shit. Gailis, I need to tell you something. Got something for me? Maybe you've heard something. I was wondering, could you put a good word in for me? I'd love to come traveling with you too sometime. I need to travel a bit, and forget about the issues at home. It would be a nice change, to be free of stress for a while. It was good seeing you, but I do need to go. Hopefully we can chat longer next time. Let's have dinner together sometime. Take care now. Hey, so... Sorry we got off on the wrong note. I understand it must be hard to side with the very thing you were sworn to destroy. I, on the other hand, am basically fighting my own kind. Oh. I'm sorry I said anything then. Thanks. Oh, and good luck on your research. Hope it goes well. Thank you. Hello, friend. Hey, what's up? I often wonder where we'd be if the Dwemer were still around. Oh well. We'll have to manage with the scraps we find. Same here. One moment they were here, and the next, no one even knew where they were. I have some theories. But who knows? We might even be able to find them, or wherever they went, someday. <sighs> well, that's it for today. I appreciate everybody who made it this far. Bear in mind the real Dirty Born is more raw and uncut, I can't really do it all, but I figure I am telling an interesting story with it. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you feel like it. I'm going to be here replenishing my ammo.